Hey guys, how's it going? So, you're about to learn one of the best card tricks ever. As long as you don't mind putting in about six hours practice every single day. I'm joking, I'm joking. This is a really easy trick, you'll love it. You're gonna be able to do it. If you're new here, I'm Matt, I'm a professional magician. And on this channel, I teach easy tricks so you can start blowing people's minds straight away. So we're gonna dive into this trick. First, I'm gonna show you performance of it so you can see what it looks like. And then we'll dive into the explanation so you can work out exactly how it's done and you can start doing it yourself. All right, guys, so this is what the trick looks like. Um, basically, before we start, I'm gonna make a prediction. So if we take one card out, uh, this is gonna be a prediction for something that's gonna happen in a minute. So then you give the cards to the person you're doing the trick to and you ask them to cut them into three piles. So they, they can cut literally anywhere they want and you show them the cards they cut to. So we've got a, a two, a five, and an eight. You say, okay, so this card's two. So we're gonna deal two cards down like this, put two cards onto each pile and leave them there. Then this is eight, so we're gonna deal eight cards. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna deal a card onto each pile and put these back. And then finally, we've got five, which is one, two, three, four, five. Card onto this pile and put these back. Now in this, the spectator can do all of that. They do it all themselves. They could cut anywhere they want. Obviously, these cards are completely random, but you say, look, I predicted a jack. If we take a look at these three cards now, you actually found all three jacks. And you've got an absolutely amazing, amazing ending to this. I think this is such an amazing trick. So this is the secret guys, it's so easy. All you're gonna do is remove any four of a kind that you want. So I like using jacks, so I'll remove the jacks. And then you need a five spot. So you need to set up before you start, Five spot on the table, you're gonna deal three cards on top of the five spot. Any three cards, doesn't matter what they are. And then you're gonna put three jacks on top and then this is gonna go on top of the deck, right? So when you look from the top of the deck, you should have your five spot, three random cards and then three jacks, okay? The other jack, you're just gonna place in the middle of the deck, just like that, right? And you are now ready to start the trick. So when you start, you're gonna give the cards a shuffle. Now. Here's how you shuffle to not disturb that little setup that you've got going on up here with your, with your jacks and stuff. So normally you shuffle the cards like this, so the cards are like face down, obviously. But if you turn the cards to the face up, start an overhand shuffle, get to about halfway and then just throw these back underneath. And that basically keeps your setup on top of the deck. So turn the cards face up, give an overhand shuffle, and this is just them really casually. You know, when you start the trick, you're like, hey, let's do a trick. Um, tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna remove a prediction. And it looks like you've really mixed the cards, but actually you've maintained your setup here on top of the pack. So when you're ready to start the trick, all you do is you turn the card towards yourself and you remove your jack. Now this is the random jack that was not part of your setup. You're gonna remove that jack. Uh, you don't let them see that it's a jack. You just place it face down and you say, this is a prediction. You then give them the cards. You put them down on the table and say, right, what I want you to do is cut about a third of the cards off the bottom of the deck like this, and then cut this pack in half. So you end up with three piles that are roughly the same size. And if you demonstrate it first, it kind of gives them the idea of what they're gonna do. So they're gonna cut about a third and then cut in half, and they end up with three random piles. So now you say, let's have a look at the cards you cut to. We've got a nine, a four, these are random, but this is the original top half of the deck, right? So when you turn this over, this is now the start of your setup, this is a five. Of course, they don't know it, you just say, you've just got to three cards, we're gonna use these three cards, and it all seems very fair. So you say, this is a nine, and you always start on the opposite side to where your setup is, so this is a nine, so we're gonna count nine cards. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and we'll put one on either packet and drop these on top. Then this is a four, so we're gonna count four. That's one, two, three, four. One on either packet and drop these on top. Finally, this is a five. One, two, three, four, five. One card on either packet and drop these on top. So you say to them, the cards were shuffled and you literally could have cut anywhere you wanted and you've ended up with these three random cards, right? Um, but this is so cool because before we started, I made a prediction, you show the jack, 
and you turn each one of these over and reveal the four jacks. I think that is such a fooler. It really is. It's such a killer trick. Love it. So that's the trick guys. I hope you like it. I think this is such a powerful trick because you literally put the deck of cards in the hands of the spectator and they do it all. They cut the cards, they do all the dealing. You're stood away, there's no way you can cheat and then they end up with this amazing, amazing finish with this four of a kind. It is so powerful. Listen, practice it, go out there and show somebody. That's why we're doing it, right? Practice it, show somebody, blow somebody's mind, make somebody smile, right? So if you like the video guys, give me a thumbs up. If you are not subscribed, how very dare you? You need to subscribe. We're gonna do videos every single Friday. It's gonna be amazing tricks like this. You don't wanna miss it. Thanks a lot guys, I'll see you soon.